Oh, my man. biggest pet peeves. My one pet peeve of Casey is that <laughs> <laughs> um, she is, and this this works if you're you know very type A. Everything needs to be planned out. Everything needs to run smoothly and accordingly, like the whole day, the whole week, maybe even the month, possibly even the year <laughs> is planned out. Um, that would be my biggest pet peeve because for me, I'm just very much of like, go with the flow, maybe it happens, we'll see kind of girl. One pet peeve, only one? Um, yeah, I would one. say uh, she just like, she'll put random things my random my stuff in random places and where I can never find it. Like I'll find like a, a charger for something in my gym bag. Her thing is, let me just out of sight, out of mind. Out of sight, out of mind. <laughs> and I'm just like, it's more, it's and for my ADD brain, it's it's a shit show because I need to know where everything's at. Okay. Your turn is time over. <laughs> <laughs> but it's 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 great. She just she picks up after me, but the thing is, she just puts everything and hides it in places, and all of a sudden I'm seeing like freaking you know, a measuring cup in my, you know, desk. That's where it, that's what it would be. K Casey's like Mrs. Fix It. I'm like, Mrs. like break it. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I break everything and she just comes in and fixes everything, so. We compliment each other very well. Yeah, oh yeah. You can break anything. <laughs> I loved cars. I love like collecting like the little metal cars. I love cars. That my, was like the one thing. My favorite toy was the yo-yo. Oh. I could, oh my God, I would spend hours playing my yo-yo. It was literally attached to my hand, literally attached to my finger. Um, and yeah, that was like my favorite. Like you did not mess with my yo-yo. Did you do yo-yo tricks? Yeah. Remember I got a yo-yo not too long ago? Yeah, I could walk it. Yeah, I could walk like, do the, the baby dog, cradle. The I could, oh, okay. yeah. uh, worst villain, Disney villain is Scar. 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 I will never forgive him for making me never. cry when I was like four years old. Yeah. To this day, I will cry if I watch Lion King. But yeah, definitely not a Scar, Scar fan. Yeah. Mufasa all day. Aww. That's a good one. Aww. If we could ask Millie anything and she could respond to, it would be, how happy are you that we picked you as our daughter? <laughs> I know. Like how, yeah, like how does she feel being our yeah. little baby? She's like the, our little daughter. That's another question too. I would ask her if she really likes her dog food. <laughs> Is it? She, of course, maybe she doesn't even need to answer that. We know she loves Would her. Would she like to try another kind? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Would she like to try another? Would you like, I don't know. Would you like to try a different brand? Would you like to try Why do you food? bother, bro, why do you bother your brother so much? A little 10 10. <laughs> She's Does she want to be a big sister? Oh yes. Would she be? Would she be excited to be a big sister? Does she want a little sister? No. Oh. She would be. Millie would be a great sister. So is Zoe. when Millie gets older, so is Zoe she'll be and such Ten Ten. A, she'll be so good. Zoe and Ten Ten. Look at Zoe. Oh, <laughs> sweet baby. I would say that I listen to my heart yeah. more than my brain, for sure. Um, yeah. I feel like you you definitely listen to your heart over your brain, but I also think that you're a very cerebral person. You definitely think about everything before you allow your heart to kind of get involved, if that makes sense at all. Oh, like being like emotionally, you're like thinking about it and like all perspectives. You're very right analytical, than, yeah. Yeah, I feel like, yeah, maybe like both. I feel like I, I do really feel like a lot, feel like, yeah. you know. And then, but then also like my mind as well. I think that goes for you as well too, baby. Yeah. That's a cool question. Yes, so fears and phobias. Oh my gosh, I have like a million, but. Which people probably don't know about. One off the top of my head is I have a severe, I have severe arachnophobia. Um, arachnophobia? Yeah. What's that mean? Like fear of spiders. So luckily we live in Arizona and I have yet to see a spider out here, knock on some wood. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> Baby, my head's not <gasps> Let's knock on some wood because um, I definitely don't wanna come across them out here in the desert, not my thing. But yeah, ever since I was little, I don't know, actually I, I do, there's a couple um, like traumatic experiences I had as a child when it came to spiders, but just overall, it's just never, I am, if I walk into, I have like spider, like I'll walk into a room and like, if there's a spider anywhere near, like I swear to God, like my eyes will just go right to it. Like I can, I just have like Maybe this sense. Maybe you are sense. a spider, baby. Maybe I'm you are not. one of the spiders. Um, so spiders. Um, I mean, I don't like, 
I don't like, I don't wanna say phobia, but like, I don't like, like big cockroaches. Like I like big flying cockroaches. Or like, I don't like, like bugs. I'm not like big bug. Person. I'm not a bug gal. Even if they're like something buzzing around, like I, I could do a fly, but not like a bee or, but I would say flying cockroaches, man. They're they just freak me out. Bugs. Huh? They're called palmetto bugs. We have them in Florida. Oh, like flying cockroaches? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't do cockroaches. You would have definitely hated Florida. It's a good thing he didn't move there with me. There's a lot of things that I have my favorite things about you, but the one thing that really stands out for me, and I wish the, I say this all the time, I wish the world could see more of it, is your goofiness, baby. You're so goofy and you make me laugh. She makes me laugh every single day. And the best, uh, one of the ones, one of the things she always does is she has like this Millie voice and she's so <laughs> good at it. She's I so created good at the Millie voice. The Millie voice and it, it just, it cracks me up. You make me laugh all the time. So yeah. that's what I love about you. I would say there's, there's many, so many reasons. Um, there's many things about you that I love. Many reasons why I love you. But I think one reason just off the top of my head would be that um, you're very much like a problem solver and if you know anything about me, you know that I have a lot of problems. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <laughs> but no, like when a problem arises, you're like very much like a do not freak out kind of person. You're very much a let's solve this now. Let's figure it out. Let's let's get this done and over with and move on. Um, whereas like I struggle with that a lot. So I'm very grateful that I, you know, have somebody like you in my life who, you know, when those times happen, you definitely help me cross that bridge. Oh, that baby. Makes sense. Well, and I mean, you saying that, it, like, the thing that I cannot do without you is you tell me to relax. Mm. They're literally, like, she has to tell me, babe, it's okay to relax. Because if without you even telling me that, I, there's no chill for me. Mm -hmm. That goes a long way, so I appreciate you. There's so many, there's so many things that I love about you. But you keep me, she'd be like, just relax. She, she kind of likes when I'm like sick, but I'm not feeling well. She's like, oh, you're not oh, feeling, no, lay down. You're not feeling well. <laughs> you want me to tuck you in? <laughs> Let me close the blinds. <laughs> take up your sacks. She loves when I relax. It really makes you happy yeah. when I relax. Yeah. Because I'm I always on you're always, 20. You're always busy, always trying to do something, figure something out, and you're, you're stressed out a lot, you know? And I, and I can see that, and I just want you to slow down and breathe. We're so different, but so alike. I love Very you. much. Love mm. you too. Well, thanks for joining us, guys. Let us know if there are any other questions. Off the wall questions. We yeah, love them. We love them. Um, put them in the comments down below. Don't forget to subscribe. And you guys, make sure you continue to follow us on YouTube. This is our reality, and we love that you guys are on this journey with us. So we yeah. love you so much. Mwah. Love you.